Welcome back to Squawk Box. Morgan Stanley shares extending earlier losses. That follows its quarterly earnings report, which showed uh, it, fall, it fell short of Wall Street estimates, both on the top and bottom line. CEO James Gorman saying the firm's results were impacted by a volatile global market environment. We're going to bring, bring in Wilfred Frost, who just spoke to the firm. Wilf. Hey, Andrew, I just spoke to the CFO, John Prusa, and he described this as a, quote, messy quarter, but great year overall. And on the year point, uh, record pro profit before tax, record revenues overall. But let's get into this messy quarter, uh, as he put it, that they just uh, reported. In particular, said it was the post-Thanksgiving period uh, that led to the various uh, disappointments. On, but, but the key thing I think we're going to hear from the analyst school is they will reiterate all of their guidance and targets for the full year ahead and focus saying it was just a, a particular five or six week, week period and it won't, uh, they hope, be repeated. So on the fixed income trading performance that came in at about 500 million, despite the long term target being at least 1 billion per quarter, uh, saying that that's been better going forward in, in January and uh, indeed that they hope to be able to reiterate that target going forward. The wealth management was the real uh, disappointment here. And they said that uh, clients' exposure to equities fell with that volatility. They saw uh, allocations to cash and cash-like securities go up to about 3 or 4% higher than it usually is. And most of that cash is still sitting on the sidelines. People haven't really reinvested it. So uh, still some benefits to come if and when uh, they do. In terms of the environment for the year, Ahead said that today versus January of last year, there's clearly a lot more uncertainty, uh, but suggested in the first three weeks of the year, things have improved from that six-week period after Thanksgiving, which uh, created the messy quarter.